Hello guys, welcome to my channel Children Diecast. If you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell for notification to see more videos like this one and other kind of video that I do in my channel. Today I have another episode of my series Gen 7 Cars on my video where I show you seven different brands of diecast cars. And I will start with Johnny Lining. Johnny Lining normally do uh, that kind of uh, models like this one. This is a 1972 Ford Grand Torino Sport. Uh, they always do uh, a metal base on those. And let me open this one. And I want to take a minute to say thank you to my friend Carla from Venezuela. She and her family, and they are always watching my videos. Thank you for the support. And say hi to the kids. This is your channel. This is a piece of, uh, it's like a coin. It's a uh, poker coin from this series Trivia Pursuit. And here is the car. It's a beautiful Gran Torino. It's a little bit heavy. Like I said, I have metal base, have real tire, rubber tire here. Check the details. It says like Goodyear in the tires. Okay. This one has an open trunk here. You can see the engine. You can find those on different stores and different websites that are dedicated to sell die cats car for collectors. It's a pretty nice Gran Torino. I love that kind of uh, casting. That's why it's in my collection, no matter the brand. All right, let me put it here. The second one is from Mini GT, another brand. This brand, you can only find it on different websites if you are interested in one of this model. They are not in store for whatever reason. And this is a, and it is here. This is a Shell BGT 500 Dragon Snake concept. I have more casting of this one from this brand in my collection. This one is heavy. Have a it's a plastic, uh, plastic hard base. I oh, don't know this one looks like metal base, but have a real tire too. You can see the details. That one is really nice because have a rubber uh, rear mirror here, and you know that Johnny Lightning don't do rear mirror even Hot Wheels. They are starting doing now, but Mini GT is the only one that have more details on their cars. Check the real lights over there. Let's see if you can see it now. Okay, you can see the red color over there. It's a very nice detail. Check the front. Check the side. Check the log over here, Dragon Snake. Pretty nice. Have it only in this side of the car. This one don't, don't have open hood. It's pretty heavy, pretty nice. If you want to start a collection, this one, this brand is pretty good. All right, let me do this one here. Okay, the next one is from Matchbox. You can find this one on stores. This is a 70 Daxon Fight and Rally. This is a Japanese car. That's why I have it in my collection. Because it's a popular casting, no matter the brand. And this one is special for me because it's a premium car from Matchbox. I have white, red, and blue color. Have a real tire. Have a metal base. And it's pretty nice. This one has a nice details here. Don't have uh, any open bar. It's a nice casting from Matchbox. My only complaint about this brand is that it's not a real 164 scale. I believe it's more 187, but still uh, very good. 
I love the casting. And it's not bad. Like I said, real tires. Different color on, on the wheels. 70 Datsun. Matchbox. Pretty nice. All right, let's move to the next one. And the next one is from Green Light. That is another good brand. You can find this one on websites and in stores. I love this one because it's from the movie Creed uh, number two, The Legend Becomes Stronger. You watch this movie, let me know in the comments and let me know if the casting looks like the real car on the movie. I'm not familiar with this movie, but here is the car, have a nice color. It's like a matte black. This brand have a metal base. All their casting are in metal base, real tire. And this is a 1967 form of Sam Coupe. Here it is. And it's from the movie Creed 2. Have a nice color, matte black, with white stripes on the top, from the back to the top. This one has open par. See the engine here. In blue. I love the rims. I'm not sure if the scale on this one is accurate, but sometimes it is, sometimes not. But they do a lot of nice details. This brand don't do the rear mirror like uh, Mini GT. But the casting is looking good. Okay, let's move to the next one. The next one is from Hot Wheel. And here is a Nissan GTR Nismo GT3. This is from 2024. You can find it on the store. It is available. It's not, you need to get it from any website. Here is the casting, it's pretty heavy, it's metal base, real tire, it's nine color, in white, have a PlayStation logo on the side, 23 over there, it's more here. Like I said, Hot Wheel now is doing the real mirror on their car, it's not an accurate detail, but Looks better than nothing. Nissan logo on the spoiler here. Nismo in the back. No tack. Still a nice casting, nice color, nice uh, white, red, and black combination. I love the color on this one. I don't know if this one is a new casting, but it's pretty good. If I see another one in another color, I will add it to my collection. This one is pretty nice. Okay. The next one is from M2. This is another brand that you can find in stores and websites. This one is a 1969 Chevrolet Camaro Super Sport. 396, the name is here. Let me put it close and fight with the light. All right. This one has a metal base. This one you can change the tires on it. Have a different kind of tires and came with the tool here, the screwdriver. We take the different rims. Pretty nice. Let's see if I can do a short video having this casting with the different rims here, or tire. It's a nice 
cast thin and it's a nice detail changing the tires and not familiar it's not my first casting like this one i have another one here that i'm able to change the tires but this one have an open hood i'm not able to open it now but let's see on the base here it's a pretty nice casting i love the chevrolet especially the one be before uh, the 80s remind me of my childhood not too old but I love the uh, muscle cars classic cars like this one it's pretty nice Blowmaster this one is from M2 older cast in a metal base sometimes the base is hard plastic or metal this one is kind of heavy but it's pretty nice Right, here is the package. I will put it here. I will do the Torino as well over there. And the last one for this video is from Outer War. This is a 2019 Dodge Challenger Hellcat SRT or SRT Hellcat. This one is exclusive from this website that. They sell that kind of cars and, and other brands. It's one of my vendors, Super Mini Wheels. Thank you for everything. And I bought this one on this website. You can find it on eBay. Yeah. It's a free ad for him, but never mind. No, no matter. It's, it's a very good. Uh, seller all right this is uh here is the challenger this one is pretty heavy have metal base have uh, real tires and check the details this one have an open hood but sometimes it's hard to open it it's okay not for this video I have more of this casting in my collection, different colors. This one is pretty nice, I have the 72. This is my year, I born in 1972. Have a cough, logo here, nice rims. The Hellcat logo on the side. Golf in the tag. It's a pretty nice casting. This is the boss to storage the car. So beautiful. Okay, guys, this is everything for this video. Thank you very much for the support to my channel. And this is everything from this series of seven cars on my video seven different brands doing the unboxing just for you guys and if you have any comment please don't hesitate do it below and don't forget to subscribe and ring the bell for notification to see more of this video or different kind of video that i have in my channel uh, I love car quarter, I love uh, team transport, I'm planning to do some videos about it. Okay guys, thank you very much and see you in the next one. Bye bye.